everyone, welcome back to another episode of Sally Face. Geeky Fun here, and let's see what mischief we can get into this time. I believe last time we were looking for antenna and batteries for the handheld game thing, but I think we found the antenna here. Did I get that new Insanity's Fall song? Yeah, man, you want to hear it? Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, like, they have really good music in this game. <laughs> Here with them. Your soul to be destroyed. Dead things. Sandy's fall. Sorry to leave you bro, but, uh... I gotta find the batteries. Oh wait, no, I'll, I'll check, uh... He's still waiting for candy, huh? Alright, well, I'm gonna check every room, because honestly, I, I'm not really sure where the batteries would be. And again, trust no toilet! Because that's just awful. Why is our kitchen always dark? I was gonna say bathroom for some reason. Why is their kitchen always- Ah! Oh, I'm in a family photo! I didn't notice that! Aw, thanks guys! Aw. I'm in a family photo. Can I get you anything? Don't trouble yourself any, Sal. Larry's taking good care of me. Well, fine. See if I wanted to help. What are you doing with that box? What have you Alright, onward. Is it like in a remote or something? Because I feel like it is. I feel like it might be in my room actually. Have you seen any ghosts lately? Nah, not really. I know she's your friend, but Megan scares my pants off. I stay in my room most times. Have you seen it? Ever seen a dip? What? Heck no. You're trying to give me nightmares? See ya. Oh, dude missing his pants. Why don't you come get your pants? I don't like anything you can use right now. Aw. Tools and junk. Has to start on bright lights. Pretty paint. Ah, uh, that's great. Let's see. We'll try... I think I'm on floor three. Or am I on floor four? Uh... David's place? College students? Uh, we'll start from the top and go from the bottom, I suppose. As much as I hate being here. Even though Megan's being an asshole! Uh, locked. That's usually the... Oh! Oh, yeah, I, I made it in here last time. Why is the birdie? Okay. I'm out. I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. No batteries. Nope. Uh, Megan. My toilet. Nope. You know what? Forget this. I'm I'm just uh I'm just gonna go to my house. Screw this. I don't wanna be here. It's dumb. Suck it. Number four, please. South place. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Uh hi kitty. <laughs> what you watching, buddy? Ah, uh, you weird cat. Where are their batteries? Where are their batteries? No bathroom batteries. Where are the batteries? No, I didn't want to talk to Kitty. I feel like I should be able to take them out of the remote. But I guess not. Hey, Dad, you got any batteries? Dad. Dad. 
I talk right now, so I have to make the deadline for work. But dad, I need batteries. I need batteries. Screw you too. I don't like your attitude. My room. Where are the batter? Oh, dude. So, okay, I guess I don't have any batteries. Whatevs. Oh, no, I don't. I don't want any anyways. Yeah, do I need them? I need it. Apparently, Robert doesn't have any batteries. Who has the batteries? And it's gonna be in an obvious place, and I'm gonna be annoyed. <laughs> I don't think anyone lives here. Maybe left her. What happened? Yes. Again, why is the camera missing from my floor? I don't appreciate that. Not in the slightest. Back to three, where we were before. See, they still have their camera. No one's home. Um, maybe, maybe the weird guy, Mr. Ant, Ant Adderson, Anderson, has a better sup, brother. See ya. See ya. Pretty busy right now, probably shouldn't bother them. I'm gonna check with... Oh wait, maybe they're in the tree house. I didn't think about that. But till then. All right. No. Oh, no. No, no. No! Batteries, come out, come out, wherever you are. Batteries! Batteries! Oh. Did I go in here earlier? Dude, you got any batteries? Let's work for reception. Uh, antenna. <laughs> Puzzle box. Yes, this will work perfectly. I'll be right back. Dude! I like your fish. That's Bob. He's okay. My parents insisted I needed more nature in my life to counterbalance all of this technology, as they put it. Hi, Bob! I like you. I like you, fishy fish. Ew, someone just cough. Fishies go poop, poop, poop. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. What the hell are they doing back there? It's very disconcerting. I'm strolling through. I'm strolling through. Who lived here moved out after what happened with Charlie? Oh, it's kind of dark and ominous. Oh, yeah, this was Charlie's place. Yeah, I'd leave too. I, I would. Man, that smell's still lingering. I'm definitely not going in there. Ew. Don't hate, appreciate. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, if it's not on the first floor, I'm gonna have to go with it's in the treehouse. And I probably should have thought of that. How may I help you, Sal? Nope, no batteries for me. I don't think anyone lives here. Apparently not. Someone's got a lot of mail. I really like this music, I'm not gonna lie. I love how his shoes are like a mix of DC and Converse. Uh, good times. Grand Grand, you got any? Nope. See you, Grand Grand. Crazy old bat. I think Mrs. Gibson would kill me if I bothered her again. Alright, to the tree house. Oh, away! Ding! Ding. Alright. Let's go. Uh, okay, so I had to go through his room, didn't I? Go through his room. Go let this away. Go outside where it's cold as shit. 
Alright. Let's see. Oh, it's so serene out here. It's so nice. Why do I feel like it's eventually going to be coated in red? Like the blood of my enemies. Alrighty then. useful in there. What about the chest? I got that weird box where it doesn't seem to be anything else of note. Where are the batteries? I don't understand. Wait, can I use the batteries in my walkie? Was that like the whole point of this? Because if it is, I'm gonna be mad. Uh, find gear boy upgrades. Walkie talkie, puzzle box, key card. So I'm thinking that quite possibly it's the walkie talkie batteries. And if that's the case, fuck my life. <laughs> Cause ain't nobody seem to got snow batteries. And this displeases me greatly. I'm just gonna go. What floor was he on? Ugh, Chug, you're such a fatty. Alright, I think he was like on floor three, was it? Eventually I remember these floors. Oh, no. Sup, brother? Nope. You can't even find your pants, let alone a pair of batteries. Chug's place. Nope, he's on my floor, pretty sure. Pretty sure. Uh, Sal's place. Nobody's place. Robert's place. Okay then, I was wrong. I suck, my bad. Ah! No. Chuck's place. How do I not remember where this dude is? I was just at his place. Uh, Charlie's old place, 203. Hi, Todd. Let's see. Yes, the- Ah! Oh! Why? <laughs> I am so dumb. Ah. Oh. Really? I thought I would still need that. Apparently not. <sighs> Yes, the battery from your walkie-talkie will work perfectly. Good thinking, Sally Face. With the two components you retrieved in my own equipment, I can adequately make the modifications to the Gear Boy. Spoke of earlier. Give me a moment to get it ready. Ooh. Well, that's loud and unpleasant. Okay, all set. Behold, the Super Gear Boy. Um, cool. Don't worry, you can still play games on it. It'll only be in ghost hunting mode with the strange cartridges in it. Oh, awesome! You had me worried for a second. However, I unfortunately needed a few parts from your walkie-talkie and we'll save it, we'll savage it. I hope that is alright. Larry's not gonna be so happy about that. It's okay though, it's for a good cause. Wonderful. Now, for the best results, you'll need to hold the system out with the antenna fully extended. To do so, press the shift button. The screen will glow if it detects any paranormal frequencies in close proximity. While it's flashing, press the R button to produce a large electrical discharge. If my theory is correct, then the surge of electricity will provide an ample source of power to energize nearby apparitions and possibly other supernatural elements, uh, elements as well. Okay, I think I get the gist of it. I suggest that we take it for a test ride in my bathroom. Sounds good. Maybe you get ready, hold up the Super Gear Boy by pressing Shift. Hmm, maybe I- Oh! 
Jesus! It worked. Oh! Uh. Okay. Holy crap. Hello. What's the matter? I never thought he'd kill them. I, it's all my fault. Who? Stacy and her daughter. Oh god, what a fool I was to fall for a married woman. It's never a crime to follow your heart. Yeah. You must be a romantic like I w was. It's kind of me to say, but I know better than that. I want to help you. Why haven't you left this place? We can never leave. What do you mean? You can't pass on? What's keeping you here? Have you seen a demon with red eyes? Can you tell us anything? No, 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 no! What? What is it? He's here! Who? The red-eyed man? The one who killed Stacy and her daughter? I have to go. I'm sorry. Ugh. Oh! That was a fully formed and conscious apparition. I've never seen anything like that. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. It's just one thing to read about the paranormal and formulate theories, and it's a whole other thing to actually experience it. I know what you mean. It's a lot to take in. Well, we have some work to do. I think I've had my fill of excitement for today, so I'll stay here and do some research. I want to look into the history of Addison Apartments, see if I can find anything about past residents and about the supposed murders. That'd be really helpful. While you do that, I'm going to go search for more supernatural hotspots. Perfect. Oh, and by the way, I know some extraneous static around the game cartridge. You may want to check it out and make sure it's okay. Alrighty then. Larry, let's go find Megan. Larry. Old buddy, old pal, let's let's go on a supernatural adventure. Yeah. Come on, buddy, let's go. Uh, Larry. Larry. Is your mom okay? Yeah, she'll be alright. Change of season always gets her. It's just a bad cold. She'll be okay. Check out the Super Gear Boy. Todd made that? It's pretty awesome. Like, Wait, is that my walkie-talkie? Oh yeah, he needed the parts for the upgrade. I hope you don't mind. I can get us new ones. Damn. Well, that's okay. Hopefully it will help you find out more about these ghosts and my curse. Agreed. I'll be back. Hasta la vista, Sally. Ha. <laughs> ah, references. Alright, well, I guess I'm gonna go find Megan. Unless, you know, I can... Look at this. Tell me if I my gear boy detect supernatural hotspots. I can use it by pressing shift. Okay. Ah! And seeking crowded start? Oh, you can actually play this? Chap why is only chapter 3 unlocked? He knew not why he was drawn to this place. Yet he could not prevent his feet from treading the dirt path before him. Perhaps it was simply curiosity. Or perhaps it was destiny. <laughs> Uh. Okay. Talk. Sorry, members only. Alright. Listen. Sounds like someone's crying. I better go check to make sure they're okay. What? All these rooms look the same. Enter. All these rooms look the same. Oh. Am I supposed to go by noises? Am I? Am I supposed to go by noises? Then I need to go by this one. I think I'm doing that. Oh! Hello. Hello, miss. Are you okay? Who are you? Pardon my rudeness, ma'am. My name is Gregory Montague. I didn't mean to intrude on you. It's just that I heard crying and wanted to make sure everything was okay. That's kind of you. I take it you're not with the men of this church. No, ma'am. It's for the best. It's terrible what goes on in this place. It keeps me up at night. I'm beginning to fear for mine and my daughter's safety. 
I've tried to reason with them. I've reached my wits end. I understand. I lost my- Oh! Am I playing the stories of the dead people? Shit. I understand I lost my family last year in the big factory fire. It breaks my heart to see a kind lady such as yourself so broken up. I'd like to help however I can. You just tell me what you need. That's awful kind of you, Mr. Montague. I'm really sorry about your family. Please, call me Greg. Pleasure to meet you, Greg. I'm Stacy Holmes. You couldn't have come along at a better time. You must be an angel. Just a humble farmer that's glad to be helpful to nice folk like you. The pleasure is all mine. Oh, I think I'm playing chapters of dead people. Ah, oh, shit. That's messed up. Well, as much as I don't want to go to, let's go to floor five and see if we can find Megan. Oh, I'm probably going to regret my life choices for this. Pretty sure I'm gonna regret my life choices of this. Uh, it was this one, wasn't it? No. No, it wasn't. That was with the birdcage. It was this one. No. Okay. Door number three. <sighs> I'm gonna regret this. I really am. Really? Nothing? I guess not. Hmm. You know, out of all the places that might have paranormal hauntings, I feel like the fifth floor would probably be one of them. Just saying. That door is locked. Oh man, do I gotta go with the dead birdie? Ah, oh, shit. Oh. oh, what is that? What did I just do? I feel like I should probably get the fuck out. Yep. Yep, let's go. Yep, no. Nope, nope, nope. Don't know what I did. I did a thing. I'm not sure I wanted to do that thing. So wait, am I just supposed to go into random bathrooms now? Alright. Yes, I'm going into random bathrooms. Bathroom. Nothing in my shit room. Alright. Let's see. Ah, oh, let's go to Larry's bathroom. And then maybe the treehouse. Uh, yeah. Larry's bathroom. Larry, I need to use your facilities. Really? Nothing in Larry's bathroom? I'm surprised. Right, I'm gonna check the thing if that- wait. wait. What? Did something happen? Did I unlock anything or- Nope. Nothing else. Alright. I guess I'll check each room down here. Oh, maybe that's what making his mom sick. Nope. Uh. Alright. I guess I'll go... Outside. Am I just supposed to go through every bathroom? I don't know, I feel like there should be something in the treehouse though. Could be wrong. I don't know. Let's find out. Oh! Oh! 
Sal? Who are you? Are you Jim Johnson? No, 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 Sal, to live in it. You're breaking up. I can't quite hear you. I, 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 I'm, oh, I, I'm sorry. I haven't much time. Just remember something. It, remember the red ball. What do you mean? What are you? To go and itch this ink. Red ball, die. <laughs> Just when I thought I was getting used to seeing ghosts, and that happens. Whatever that was. My life is weird. Mood apathetic. <sighs> A red ball. Huh. Alright. So it looks like some number two unlocked. Chapter two. And the mysterious old woman gazed once again into Jim's eyes and said, If you can find the door this key unlocks, we will share the secrets of the universe with you. Oh! Oops. Ah! It's very touchy. Alright. I don't know. Alright. Ah! Stop zapping me! Okay. Button! Magical button! Alright. I don't under really get what the hell's going on, but alright. Let's go. That looks like a door or a trap door. I don't know, I could be wrong. And what is all this stuff anyways? Ah! What? Ah! Help! Alright, um, what is the point of this? Like, I didn't really understand anything that guy said, so I really don't know what this one's about. I mean... Was Anderson Apartments the old church? Didn't they mention it was built on something? I don't remember what they said it was built on though. It might have been a church. That would have helped if I remembered, but I don't. Inconvenience at its finest. I'm the one that inconvenienced myself. Alright. Button! Alright. At least if I like m hit one of these things, I don't have to start the whole freaking thing over. Top matrix with stereo sound. That's awesome. Do do. I'm not gonna lie. Like this game, like I'm. I really appreciate the music they put into this game. All right. No. Dude, how many rooms are there? Just, just asking for a friend. Ah, oh, that was close. Woo! Oh. Oh. Use key. What the fuck? Alrighty then. Alright everyone, well I think I'm gonna end the video here. Um found a battery so that's plus and at least we get to play the game gear boy that's what's called uh but i really appreciate your support please leave a thumbs up or a comment down below and always feel free to subscribe it's much appreciated and as always guys thanks for being awesome stay geeky bye bye